Hello YouTube, Bookum Dano here. I uh, wanted to make a contest ent entry for uh, Keek Comic Market Watch um, 200 sub contest. So uh, he was looking for the best deal we've ever made with a comic, um, the worst deal uh, we've ever made, and then to give a shout out to a couple other uh, YouTube channels. Um, so I'll start with the, you know, the probably the worst decision um it was a online comic auction it was a comic store that had gone out of business and their stuff was in storage apparently and then the all the uh everything was being liquidated at an auction um so i had bid on several long boxes uh, this was in california i live in the midwest so you know everything had to be shipped um but i won i think four different long boxes um and you know the 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 total outlay wasn't that much i guess considering how many comics there were there was one long box just full of uh, like batman graphic novels um but the the thing is there is a lot of like garbage mixed in with the decent issues so you know like i got a lot of uh solid batman legends of the dark knight stuff like that um but then there was just a ton of stuff that went nowhere from the 90s um now on the plus side a lot of it was in super high grade so you know like there's a nice run of uh, ghost rider from the 90 from 1990 volume volume 2 ghost rider um, there was a bunch of Conan comics that were super high grade, you know, nine six, nine eight, I would say. Um, but they weren't any kind of key issues, you know. They're from later in the in the Conan run. So a lot of stuff like that, and there's some humor stuff, and um, so anyway, you know, late I I purchased everything with the idea of selling most of it and uh you know make it a fortune um it hasn't turned out that way uh first of all it's a it's a lot of work and i'm sure any of you that have you know purchased about you know more than one long box and tried to you know get it ready for sale and make sure you know what you have and do the research on it it's it's a lot of work and then when you end up you know trying to sell those books at two or three dollars a piece you know um it's it's a lot of it's a lot of work but it has been super educational and uh, you know i've learned a lot along the way um i don't think it's going to be you know I, I i should get my money out of it for example there was two first printings of uh the killing joke and i got one of them graded um last year and i auctioned it through uh, uh my comic shop and even so after it was came back as a 9.2 from cbcs uh, but the hammer price on the sale was still like 150 bucks which seemed pretty strong to me but you know obviously no complaints so but even after you know the grading fee shipping it to my comic shop um their commission on it i still cleared over 100 bucks on it and that was you know one issue out of um you know the 1200 or so that uh that i got in this lot and I've, I've sold a few other things and um i've got a and at, there's an antique mall in town where i sell some books used books and and comics um so i've got some stuff there for sale as well but it's you know it's a slow process and it's uh you know, I'm not real, real big hurry to do something like that, that again, unless the, it's like all Marvel Silver Age keys or something like that that you can move quickly. Um, so that you know that was a that was definitely the learning experience one. The um, the success story though is is also from a comic auction, comic store um, closing auction. Um, one of my local comic shops closed last uh, summer, 
I've done a few videos on it, so you guys probably know that I've got some pretty cool stuff there. Um, but in the week or two before the auction, the guy was, uh, the owner had put out a ton of back issues that he was selling for 25 cents a piece. And I got there and, um, you know, there's a couple different, there's a couple tables laid end to end with these long boxes on them. Long boxes and short boxes, I should say. And uh, there's a bunch of guys at either end. So I went to the middle and just kind of lucked into this uh, short box full of uh, variant covers. What I should have done was just buy the whole short box. But instead I, you know, tried to cherry pick it. Didn't know entirely what I was 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 doing. But um, long story short, this is uh, one of... The books I got it's Superior Spider-Man number one it is the Caseta sketch variant it's a 1 in 150 uh, variant and I don't know if you can see the price here but it's you know originally retailed at $150 um, I'm gonna send this off to CGC to get graded and um, uh, then then auction that off and we'll see we'll see what it what happens with that so you know, for a quarter plus grading fees, you know, that should end up, that should work out okay. Um, there's a bunch of stories like that. That's probably the most, you know, the, the biggest. I At the auction itself for this comic shop, I um, purchased like almost a full run of Sandman comics. And it was like $2.25 for issues number two through 65. And I think they were missing one issue from, you know, issue like 63 or something it was missing. And, of course, issue number one. And I just traded those into my other comic shop for uh, $180 credit and then used that credit to buy a, a Silver Age uh, Justice League book uh, and, and some more stuff. But um, so, so that was cool. Um, <laughs> learning all the time. So as far as the shout-outs go... Um, I want to uh, first thank Key Comics Market Watch for, uh, you know, for his channel. I'm, he puts up videos so often, um, sometimes it's hard to keep up. And, man, I don't even know how you do it, but you know, keep it up. I appreciate it. I'm always learning something from, from your channel, so, so that's cool. And I love this contest idea of shouting out to channels that don't, uh, don't have a lot of subscribers yet. So my two shout-outs are... Uh, the first one is Saddle City Comics, Saddle City Comics, and the other one is um, Certified Comic Shop. So check out those two channels. Um, Certified Comic Shop is, uh, uh, you know, the guy's trying to integrate his his uh, online store with his YouTube channel, trying to explain, you know, what he, what he's doing, what he's looking for, how he does business, and um, I, you know, I think that's pretty cool and was worth uh, worth pointing out. Saddle City is really cool. They've got a ton of videos up. Just check them out. So that's my contest entry. Thanks a lot.